Good morning and welcome to another mod review with me, the Xbox Farmer. These dropped yesterday, the 22nd, and the first one are these two beautiful tractors. And it's the Fiat Agri 160.55 and it's an updated mod and it's by Pepe978 Sexel Cracking little mods Now I notice when you do it in cab view you get like a black flickering but it's only when you do it in cab view but look at the animations <laughs> that's cracking, I love that Listen to the sound of it when it starts up, it's brilliant. <laughs> I love that sound. That's amazing. It's just a bit about black. You can see the dial moving. <laughs> the levers, obviously. We have lights. Position one. So, button three. We also have the, um, the gears left. All right. Are the same, but obviously without the cab one. Option one, position one, position two gets a bit brighter. Oh, and position three. Weird glitching. Which is a shame because the detail on it is amazing. Right down to the floor well, the foot well. Detail down there. Just that weird glitching. Anyway, they're still cracking mods, they're still beautiful looking tractors. Really, yeah. Uh... Right, let's have a look at them in the shop. The medium tractors. Forty-five thousand to buy, and they both have a slot count of nine options. The design colour from New Holland to Fiat Agri. 
slight difference. I just think one's a bit deeper. Configuration, 500 gram, sorry, 500 kilogram weight at the front, or 800 kilogram weight at the front. Rear linkage. Rear linkage with weight and a 500 or 900 kilogram. Like I say, you got it with cab, without cab, sorry, or with cab. You've got the Fiat Tagri without cab design and also with cab. So that's the updated Fiat Agri 160 55 pack by Pepe 978 Zexwell, Zexl, sorry. Really lo lovely looking mods them. I really like them and I like the sound effects on them as well and the animation. Right, next. We have another update, and this is the Forshire E281C pack by Triple A Modding. Really lovely, well designed mods. Also, has see that door open? I just missed it, then didn't you? <laughs> That's when you get in and out. And there's a thing that just moves forward. That opens and closes. You get in, and that falls down. A lovely sound effect. Lights, front lights, and cab lights, and then a light on the arm, uh, or the pipe. <laughs> I love it. And the sound effects. So this also comes with a pack of headers. I'll just quickly show you, um, show you the headers. So we have the E296 B. That'll cost you uh, 11 slot counts, priced at 15,000. We have the E299, cost you 14,000 with a slot count of 11. Lastly, we have the E294 with a slot count of 7, and that'll cost you 12,000. So, that one does your grass, 
Uh, that one does your corn. And now that one does your, or your others, your wheat, your barley, etc. Soya beans. I've also noticed that they only attach to this sort of attachment. Alright, we'll have a look in the shop under forest harvesters. It's the E281C, it's priced at 64,000 with a 22 slot count. And that's by AAA Modding. Lovely. Lovely good animation on it as well. I do like this. I do like how it starts out. Yeah, it only attaches to them so. I'll just switch my open one. This is the calm one. Very well made, very well designed inside. All the detailing on the, on the metal. So, pipe out. It auto takes your trailer down the harvester. That's your corn one with the corn fields. It's all like that, it starts up the sound effect, it's amazing. This one has a trailer built into it. Just unfold it. Did that just pick up some grass as well? Well, it would see that this picks grass up as well.
Let's see what's going on here. I think that picked up grass and it's filled a trailer with grass. Why it's that big pressure, I don't know. If that's the case, then you might be able to use it as a as a mower. have a little test while we're here. So yeah, as well as uh, the forage harvester, you can use it as a mower and collect your grass. Well, that's an unexpected surprise. Definitely grass. But it'll do you when you're on your fields, it turns into chaff, which is the whole idea of the, of the forest harvester. As a bonus, it'll mow and pick up the grass. This is the actual grass one. This should turn grass into chaff. I don't know if it'll pick up cut grass. It's picking it up but it's not turning it into a shaft is it? It's just picking up the grass. Dry, fresh, and cut grass. It has no effect. Strange. I thought this was the best one. I got my symbols wrong. Grass and hair. So that's right. Why is it not turning into a shaft?
I don't know why that's not picking up and turning the shaft. But it will pick your grass up. But I'd use the other head and have it mow, mow your grass and collect at the same time. Well, that's the updated Forshire E281 C pack by AAA Modding. I'm surprised. And lastly, we have we have a crane building or overhead crane by DD Mod Passion with a six slot count. Priced at a hundred thousand. Now, I remember seeing this on one of the maps in FS17, and it was actually over a set of tracks, train tracks. So I, I, I'm not hundred percent sure if it's meant for train tracks, or I suppose you could use it for unloading wagons, but. You know, I don't know whether you can make tracks in a map editor. But we've got different cam we can in cab view. So it's got all your basic commands really, your left bumper and your right stick left and right, your right stick up and down brings it away and back, your, your right bumper raise and lower with your right stick and your LB and RB and right stick close and opens. So that's the new crane building by DD Mod Passion. We'll just have a look at it in the store. Some replaceables, miscellaneous. It priced at a hundred thousand with a slot count of six. So yeah, I mean, great design. And it does just look like the one that I did on FS17. But like I say, it was over a railroad. And I don't know if you can add tracks on console version. I don't know, maybe the flat flat map but I've not I've not tried that because I don't think it's really designed for consoles myself that's just my opinion maybe you can do if you can lay railroads I'm sure you can on PC but this is console I don't really know how you'd use this without railroads but there you have it I mean really good detailing texture on it you know if someone's come up with an idea of how to use it other than it going over some railroad tracks then please let me know I'd love to know well, that's it for this time. As I say, these mods came out on the 22nd. Hope you've uh, enjoyed it. Hope you found it informative. Please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Uh, please hit the bell for, for future videos. 
And you know by now, as always, thanks for watching. Goodbye.